Why do you think more people don't know about Bob Marley accepting Jesus seven think, months before he passed? I think there's a few reasons. Number one, it doesn't fit with the family's brand and it doesn't sell his mm. catalog. He never recorded anything new. Mm -hmm. He was sick. He was dying of cancer. He went to this, you know, faraway place. I think it was in Germany or Austria trying this holistic thing. It didn't work. And they basically gave up. And mm. at that point, about seven months before he died, he then spoke with Archbishop Yesak and supposedly cried for like two hours, weeping, mm -hmm. weeping in tears of repentance. Mm -hmm. But he never used his voice from that moment on mm. to set things straight. Mm. He was buried and the whole funeral happened through the Ethiopian Orthodox Church. So, you know, there is that side of it. And there is Archbishop Yesak going and telling others. And, yeah. and, I, and I was there for interviews where he did that. Yeah. But... That being said, a lot of people see it as a deathbed conversion, mm. which I think is valid. Mm -hmm. But they say, oh, yeah, well, look at his catalog, and he's singing about all these other things. But he also said, I'll never forget no way how they crucified Jesus Christ. Mm. He also said, don't you know that the wages of sin is death, mm -hmm. etc." Yeah, that definitely changes the, the narrative if the guy of Rastafarianism actually repented and became a Christian. <laughs> yeah, and the guy who he was worshiping yeah. was always a Christian. Was always a Christian. You know, from a youth, he was a Christian. Yeah. And it all started when Bob, after doing Zimbabwe tour, which was just this insane freedom rally, uh, independence, he then went and flew to Ethiopia and he was like, how come nobody's worshiping my God? Mm -hmm. And they're like, because uh, he was a king that is now dead yeah. and he's buried over here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yep. And so he then wrote Jalive mm -hmm. and he's talking about how can you say that God is dead? Yeah. But I think it, it, it kind of poked something in yeah. him. And eventually it started to come out. The baptism is verified though, right? The baptism like is verified, yeah. Barely Ethiopian verified. Orthodox. And obviously the Orthodox funeral is verified. Yeah, and you cannot have an Orthodox funeral without having the baptism and being converted. Others would argue that he just did that so that he could be buried. But it doesn't really matter it, what Bob Marley believed. It matters what you believe. Yeah. <laughs>